Hey there, today's video will show you how to create a Flutter PDF editor with CompDF Kit. This video will contain two parts. How to build a Flutter PDF editor in Android with CompDF Kit. Firstly, please check whether you have met these requirements. Then, please get a 30-day free license key by clicking here and choosing Flutter on the platforms. Step 1. Create a Flutter example project with Flutter CLI and change the current working directory to your project in the terminal application. Step 2. Open the folder and add OpenPD storage permissions. Step 3. Open the application's Gradle build file. Step 4. Change the minimum SDK version. Step 5. Open the main activity class of the project. Step 6. Add CompDF kit dependency. Step 7. Run the flutterpub get command from the terminal application to get all packages. Step 8. Open the folder and replace all the contents with the sample code and fill in the license provided to you in the compdfkit.init method. This simple example can help you load a PDF document from the local device file system. Step 9. Add the PDF document you want to display to your project by creating a PDF directory and copying the sample document into the newly created PDF directory. Step 10. Open the specified asset directory. Now, you can use the CPDF Reader widget small components with our CompDF Kit PDF SDK. Step 11. Now start your Android emulator or connect your device and start running the application. Part 2. How to build your Flutter PDF editor in iOS with CompDF Kit. Just like in Android, you also need to confirm that you meet these requirements. Step 1. Create an example Flutter project with Flutter CLI and change the current working directory to your project in the terminal application. Step 2. Add CompDF Kit dependency. Step 3. Run the command from the terminal application to get all packages. Step 4. Open the project's pod file in a text editor. Step 5. Update the platform to iOS 12 and add CompDF Kit pod spec. Step 6. Go to the folder and run the pod install command. Step 7. Privacy settings. Before accessing sensitive data, you need to set up privacy settings. Step 8. Open the folder and replace all the contents with the sample code. Fill in the license provided to you in the compdfkit.init method. Step 9. Open the specified asset directory. You also can use the CPDF reader widget small components with our compdfkit PDF SDK like in Android. Step 10. Now start your iOS simulator or connect the device and start running the application by running Flutter Run command. So far, you can easily build your Flutter PDF editor on Android and iOS platforms by integrating the CompDF Kit SDK. If you have any questions, you can get timely help by contacting CompDF Kit. That's all. See you next time.